good for against rheumatism, arthritis, lumbago, sciatica, cartilage problem, gout, cramps and veins. Veins means varicose veins. Take a very little red oil on your hand, just rub it on well and massage, there is the massage oil. In state of the cortisone injections in Sri Lankan, most people we use red oil. That's why the houses, we got a bottle of red oil, then we call home doctor, because it's good for everything. And also sometimes you can see if you got any troubles on your joint, an example sneeze. Uh -huh. At such a time the doctors they the injection, steroids, yeah, yeah, cortisone. Yeah, yeah. Normally the doctors they give only three times the cortisone injection because of they a lot of side effects. Yeah. That means when you take some cortisone injection, your body gets so fat, sometimes swelling. Yeah. Also from the cortisone injection, your blood nerves and veins keep it too dry. Then it won't expand it. Then the blood circulation again is not good. Pain gradually come back. Mm -hmm. Then when you're going back to the hospital, after three cortisone injections, the doctors they try to operate it and they have put any plastic surgery. But say madam, in the winter time you've got a such a big trouble. But at such a time when you come to the hot countries, no aches, no pains, nothing. Because of the humidity. That's why Sri Lanka we make red oil. When you rub little on your joints on your muscles, within a few minutes you can feel it's very hot, very warm. Then if they have any water inside the joints, according to the heat of the oil, they take the water out and they are burning. The humidity, they are doing the same effect. According to the heat of the oil, all the blood veins and vessels make it bigger, expand it. Then the blood, they pump it well. Humidity, they are doing the same thing. Otherwise, winter time, your joints will get locked because of the damp. At such a time, when you come to the hot countries, then your joints will keep it so loose. The red oil, when you rub, it gives the same effect. Your joints keep it so loose. And according to the heat of the oil, your muscles keep it loose. Then the blood veins and vessels expand it. They pump the blood. In the same time, they bring the oxygen to the muscle. That's why we use for massage the red oil. Just now, if you have any aches and pains on your neck, body, muscles, on your arms, on your leg, I will drop tiny little red oil on it. Just now, I will show you how they feel it. Get so relaxed and comfortable feeling. If you like to take a little neck massage out of the red oil, I will do it your nice way. Oh, yeah? Yeah. You like? Yeah. Yeah, massage. I will do it little neck. So, so what are the ingredients of this tea? Can you In the tea you got ginger, cinnamon, cardamom, uh, together with black tea leaves but no sugar, without sugar with one or two drops of vanilla essence. That we call it spice tea, Ayurvedic herbal tea.